Well, those showers you alluded to, nothing quite like the powerful storm system that hit Texas with at least four people dead after wind and rain slammed into the southeastern part of the state. That's for the second time this month. It's prompted hundreds of thousands of people to shelter in place. Dave Malkoff shows us how the storm took dead aim on the biggest city in the Lone Star State. This is in downtown Houston. The winds were 100 miles per hour as they quickly roared through this major American city. A thunderstorm so fierce it produced wind gusts that blew out some of the skyscraper windows. We all took cover in the bathroom. Windows blowing out, trees flying everywhere. It was crazy. Generated enough rain that even modern buildings like this downtown hotel couldn't keep the water out. And at Minute Maid Park, home of the Astros, its covered stadium barely able to do the same. The city streets are littered with debris, fallen trees, and siding of buildings. Houston's mayor has warned people to stay away. It'll take 24 hours for a lot of this power to be restored. Some will require 48 hours. So we're in a recovery mode. The storm took a toll on areas outside the city too, causing power transformers to explode and bending those giant utility towers, knocking out power to about one million customers. All this was someone's house. It's this was everyone's lives, just on the street. Just north of Houston, rounds of extreme weather have slammed the area in recent weeks. I walked around Courtney Emmons' neighborhood just before the latest storms hit. She's still shaken up in the aftermath of the recent flooding. In Conroe, we could see debris everywhere, furniture, personal items, insulation material that used to be inside homes, reduced to garbage sitting on the curb. Look yeah. at that piano. I know, that's probably a family heirloom. And now it's gone. But it wasn't flooding, it was high, high winds in excess of 100 miles an hour above hurricane strength that took the bricks off the side of this building right here. This is a popular club in downtown Houston. You can see the LED panels on the opposite end of the dance floor from the DJ booth. Those are just kind of swinging here. We heard from somebody who works here who said nobody was in there. They posted on Instagram that nobody was hurt, but this was definitely a deadly storm here in Houston that moved on to Louisiana. In downtown Houston, I'm Dave Malkoff, CBS News.